Alright, hello everyone and welcome back to episode 2 of Small Radio Big Television. I'm probably going to get that mixed up or backwards at some point in this Let's Play. But yeah, we're back for episode 2, leaving right where we left off. Ooh, this is kind of spooky. Um, oh, what were they built for in a row? I never actually told me Optimus about this, to give people a sense this could get better, and somehow everything could be normal again one day. This is my best radio, uh, static-y impression. Like, I guess I didn't convince you. It was empty. There wasn't a person in sight, whatever. They were trying to do what they gave up fast. No motivation. So they were... What, what were they trying... They were... Air? Supposedly, filter the air, the water, and they could the population from plummeting. Is that Morse code? Because I don't know. The square root of raspberry should be legalized. Comment below if you get that reference. That's an ancient YouTube reference. The worst part is the people working there believe it was possible. I mean, why would you also just spend your life in a place like that, you know? That's insane. Maybe they just wanted to find purpose to feel like they were contributing. Hmm. I just think they found something that was more compelling. Okay, so I, is this where I use this lady, this mirror? It's a mirror thing, okay. Hey, okay, so that's where this thing uh, comes into play. So the story of the thing is sort of coming together. I guess this cutscene sort of adds a little more depth to it, but it's slowly starting to make a little bit more sense as we're getting deeper into the game, which I guess makes sense. That's probably the purpose of any plotline or story is to get more in depth the further you go. Okay, ooh, what is this? Okay, so this is another uh, world. And for the length of these of these episodes, I don't know how long I'm going to make each episode. It's just how I feel. Um, when it feels right to end it, I'll end it, you know, like at a good stopping point. I'm not just going to abruptly end it in the middle. All right, so let's let's go let's go here. Hmm. Caution fall. Okay, so let's search for more tapes. I assume that's what we're doing. Um, uh, there's a f switch. Can I hit that? What does that do? I'm just going to leave that off. I'm sure that does something because otherwise there wouldn't be a switch. Why would they just have a redundant switch? Maybe it turned off some of the battery. Uh, so that's where we came from. Uh, we could go there. Is there anything up here? There's a door here. I kind of just want to go through this door. Uh, it's locked. Okay, yeah. So it's one of these two. Let's go left. Um, alright, so there's the three gears. That's where we gotta grind the tapes if we do another similar. So let's go back. Can I go in? Ooh, I might have been able to go in that vent, actually. So let's go back real fast. And cannot go in the vent. Alright, and go in back. I remember in the last, like, section we went in the vent. But apparently that vent you can't go in. Let's go to the right, because if it ain't right, it ain't right. <laughs> Alright, um, I'm not seeing any tapes. Okay, let's, let's go down here. Um, there's a box and needs a hexagonal thing there. Uh, more boxes. How have I not found any tapes yet? This is crazy. Normally, like, the, like, at least the first section, the tapes were fairly local. <laughs> fairly easy to find. Uh, I guess I'll just go to the left. I mean, we gotta find a tape eventually, right? Uh, okay, so that takes us back to this room. So let's go up. Let's go here. I'm going in so many doors that I haven't been in before. I'm bound to run into a tape eventually, right? Um, this door? I am. We're back outside. All right. Maybe I needed to not turn that one thing off that I turned off in the beginning. Let's go back. That's not going back. Let's spin the world. If only you could spin life like, like that. Excuse me. Spin. Can it? Can this not spin? Okay, so we can't sp rotate this world? Question mark. Oh, all right, and I guess you can't rotate until you unlock the other sides. Makes sense, because then if you just rotate, you could just go to all the things, and that would defeat the whole purpose of the thingy. Uh, what is that? What is that? Um, let's go right. I don't know. I just want to find a tape. I just want to find a tape. Yes, I understand that it's locked. Yada yada yada. Alright, um, 
I need to somehow get back to that beginning part so I can change the switch. Uh, here we go. We're getting there. It was here is where we came from to get that switch. Maybe here. Wait, this is just looking like that one room. Well, there was... There's a power switch here. Was this it? Yeah, this is it. Okay, so we're going to leave the power switch on this time. And now we're going to explore and see what happens. Okay. So now this thing's doing things. <laughs> um, can I go in this door? I can't go in that door. I can spin the gear? What? Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, okay. I can slide this to the left a little bit. Uh, what does that do? Not sure. Uh, still can't go in the door. Can I, like, slide it back? Can I, like... Do a, do a pattern? I don't know. Um, but hopefully to turning that thing on does something. Because right now I'm a little bit lost, to tell you the truth. And uh, being lost is not the most compelling gameplay. But I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're sticking sticking around for the ride. Because it's like, we gotta, we gotta find these things. And we can't go there. So literally the only option is here using process of elimination came through that door so there's two options from here so let's go here coming through this door um how can i not find any types okay we're going here so we're back to this room we're back to square numero uno maybe uh i don't know i am so lost i haven't been this lost in like since I watched a TV show. <clears throat> so... Alright. I need to start, like, messing with the gears or something. Because I think I've explored, like, all the rooms and stuff. And so what I haven't done is, like, clicked on random things in rooms. So what I'm gonna do is click on... See if I can click on these random things. Uh, nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, so let's go backwards. Let's work our way back. Uh, and let's figure this out. Sorry if this is kind of frustrating to watch. It's kind of frustrating to play as as well. Um, just because I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Maybe. But, like, I already explored with the switch off. So you'd think, you'd think that having... Okay. Maybe I turn the gear... I slide the gear to the left here. I slide the gear to the left. And then I go and I turn off the switch. Turn off the power. Maybe that'll do something. Let's try that. Okay. Come on. That's my that's like my last guess. Is that it? That's it. All right, we did it. We did it. We've done it. I've figured it out. I'm not an idiot. Take that internet. All right. And we found our first tape. That's the one thing you risk with doing let's plays on the internet. You risk looking dumb for the rest of your life cuz it's on the internet forever and ever. All right. So let's first tape, baby. What is this? A our board Arboretum? I don't know what that word is. I'm not dumb, I swear. Ooh, this is beautiful. It's like, oh, okay. It's like a nice fall day, unlike Virginia here. It is still like not even fall weather in November, which doesn't make sense. But this is beautiful. Oh my. Wow. I like this. Can I just live here? Like, dang. This is good stuff. Um. I'm not seeing any hexagonal things, so I'm guessing we'll have to grind the gear to find that. So let's exit out of this. But we got our first tape, so we're making progress. We're working away. We're doing our thing. Uh, notice, keep this area clear. Anything else in here? Doesn't look like it. Um, all right, so let's leave. So we're making some sort of progress, um, at least. Let's go here, and let's keep looking for things. Uh, was this gear moving before? Don't know, but I hope I hope we're doing things right now, you know? And I figured one thing out. Hopefully I can figure the rest of the things out. So, uh, man, I really want a hexagonal. Maybe if I go to the grind, maybe I have to grind it to get the hexagonal to go there to get more tapes. Is That's, that's, that's my theory at the moment. That's my at the moment theory. Hashtag at the moment theory. That could be a cool name for like a show or something at the moment theory or like a segment on a segment on a podcast. Let's go back in there. Uh, at, hashtag at the moment theory in the comment section down below. <laughs> All right. Um, so let's go down here because we went from there. We went straight up to there. Here's the gear grinder. So I'm going to click that. 
So I'm going to throw it in there. I should grind that tape, and I should be able to get the hexagonal thing out now, I believe. All right. So let's put the arbitorum, whatever, whatever word that is. And let's put it back in the cassette player. If that's, yeah, that's what that is. Arboretum. Arboretum. I kind of want to Google that. All right. Well, we need to find, I see it. Got it. All right. And while we're getting this thing, we're going to Google the definition of arboretum because I don't know what that is. Because our, arboretum search. Here we go. Uh, the U.S. National Arboretum is a U.S. Department of Agriculture Research and Education facility and a living museum. Okay. That kind of makes sense, I guess. Um, that makes sense as to why I wouldn't know that word if it's um, a museum and slash exhibit slash agriculture type thing. Because I ain't no farmer. Um, which which way was the thingy? Which, which, which I think, uh, I think, oh yeah, we gotta go. I keep closing the stinking doors. Stinking doors, that's right, you heard me. Alright, so we should now be able to throw this up in there. Bam, bam, thank you, ma'am. And we can enter this door. So hopefully we can find our second cassette tape here. And or we can rotate the building now. Uh, what did that do? Is this like a whole new area? If that unlocked a new area, that's awesome. That would... Yes, okay. It unlocked a whole new area. Thank goodness. That took me way too long to solve the puzzle in that first area. I apologize for that. But a longer episode for you guys. So, you know. Uh, the more uh, the more time, the merrier. <laughs> Alright. Uh, here's another place to grind gears. Really grinding my gears. Um, but we gotta find a tape first. Oh, I can go in here. Okay. I'm just sort of like traversing around this whole... Uh, whole section searching for the tapes uh far and wide <laughs> this pokemon now um honestly right now i'm clicking doors i should use strategy because it wasn't easy to find the first part so it's not going to be straightforward and easy to find the second part and i should know that and stop being dumb um all right so let's go into here all right so we went that door so let's go this door this time Okay, so we haven't been over here. It looks like the only thing I can click... It says Magnets Corrupt. That might mean something. These might be clues. There might be hidden clues throughout this whole map, and I had just been oblivious the entire time. Like, solve the puzzle by doing this, and it's just on the wall, and I just haven't noticed the entire time. Quiet. It's a, it's a possibility. Uh, let's go down here. Um, Is there anything up? Because I didn't look up. Ooh, ooh, I saw something. I saw a cursor click. I saw a clicky cursor. I saw a clicky cursor. Okay, it's, it's probably nothing. But I saw a clicky cursor, I'll tell you that much. Dern sure saw that clicky cursor. Um, so we can't do that. Um, is it a possibility that I... No, there's no way. I have to go back to the other side of this world well there's one more door i haven't entered from the outside which might be what i need to do so that's what i'm gonna bang. let me make sure that i can't go on the vents yeah so i'm gonna try and get back to the outside and then we're gonna enter in the top right one is that a carrot i don't know we're gonna try and enter in the top right one and we're gonna see what happens um okay so this is where i entered the thing to, to do the thingy the thingy majig thing let's let's look at this tape again because if there's, like, more than one hexagonal thing, that would be good to know. Just in case I'm missing something, because I don't want to miss anything. Uh, Alright, let's see. It's so creepy. After the... Oh, my gosh. After you grind the gears, it just turns into a phantasmal horror scene. It's crazy. Um, Yeah, it doesn't look like anything else is in here. And I'm, I am I guarantee, like, I, I'm done with this area. I'm done with this area. I don't need anything else out of this area. So we're going to come back out. Can I rotate the world now? Oh, my gosh. I can rotate the world. Okay. We're going in here now. Is, But I've... But this is just putting me back in the other side of the world. Uh, I don't know what to do, don't know what to do, don't know what to do, don't know what to do. Let's try this door. It'll probably put me in another place that I've already been. Yes, already been here. Okay, let's go back out and let's rotate it back. 
Let's bring it, bring it around, bring it around town. All right, but this episode is dragging on dangerously long, so I think I'm going to call episode two off right here. I want to thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to hit that like button, maybe subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be uploading a new episode of this Let's Play every single day until I finish this game. So if you definitely want to uh, watch more of this game and watch me play it, hit that subscribe button. But other than that, I hope you're having an absolutely wonderful day or night whenever you're watching this. You're an amazing person, and I will see you in the next video. Take care.